Amara style was somewhat inspired by the 80s, and I grew up in the 80s. We like to think of Amara as her own fashion plate. She owns these things, she's collected these things, and puts it together in her mind to amplify her glamour. You and me have a dream tonight. We decide how to work together. We made two big items for her for the, um, the duration of the show. We did this zebra awesomeness. And when she went to LA, she wore this a lot. Um, this is another coat we made for her. This is my suit of armor that I'm wearing. These are my Wonder Woman cuffs. This is my protection that I'm wearing into the battlefield to both signal who I am so I can be symbol, you know, recognized immediately and as a sort of a defense for me and totems and things that, that make me feel protected. You walk over me because I am a woman? You little dick maricorn? You have one hour to go back up north or I cut your fucking legs off. There's so many boys on this show and she's like more powerful than any of them and she makes them shake in their shoes. I don't think she has any problems with flaunting her femininity. And the styling is absolutely flattering and incredible. I've never felt prettier. 